My ways too small, my face too cute, my game too strong, your man too close, he on my phone about these bills. Put mommy on the phone, he ain't never coming on. Look, I'm about to go in, I'ma get inside these bitches head like a sewing. I'ma lace the track in the front, make it blend in, pull that shit back so the glue ain't sh- Five G's. Give me a minute, girl. I don't want to be smacking in your ear. Grapes. So, Pisces, we're here to talk about your life for the month of May. Any place with a Pisces, please check your chart. So, if you know this is the correct room for you to be in, okay? Sun, Moon, Mercury, Rising, Venus, Mars. Jupiter, Saturn, North Node, and South Node placements. Anybody who would like to be nosy because I promise you they are in here. So, um, thank you to everybody that's been booking with the general readings. I appreciate it. It is still active um, for thirty nine thirty nine. so book while you can. Pisces, I've already pulled the zodiac signs that you guys could be around, who um, the messages in this reading could be about, what placements you guys might have, and what other readings, uh, monthly readings, might have some messages for you. So, we have Taurus, Sagittarius, Libra, and then we have Pisces showing up on the bottom of the deck. So, could there be another Pisces outside your energy? Maybe. But y'all know whenever I see the zodiac of the sign that I'm reading for, that means you can have any placement of said sign and some messages in here will definitely resonate with you. So, overall energy for the month of May, Pisces, is a toxic man. It's crazy because in Aries reading, I was warning them about a toxic woman. So, is this part the or are you part un? What, what, how does it go? What's the order? So we have karmic masculine showing up. So either there is a toxic Pisces man or Pisces. I could just be warning you about some sort of uh, toxic man around you during this time. And you'll know they're toxic because look what's showing up on the bottom of the day. They're draining your energy. So this varies from someone taking advantage of you. Someone um, not being uh, considerate of you. Someone... Uh, not caring about how their actions affect you. By the way, I left him on the ground. I said him. Is this a him? I left this car on the ground because I knew I was going to forget. And I date. So while I was shuffling um, the Zodiac deck, Gemini fell out on the floor and it fell out booty up. So uh, Pisces, some of you guys could have gotten rid of a Gemini due to the fact that maybe you thought that they weren't being um, truthful, they weren't being honest with you, or this could have been like, you know, a fuck you too then, bitch type situation, okay? You don't want to deal with them, so you know they get all in a tiff and want to get a little, little, little sassy with you, right? So let's put some cards, talk some shit, the norm, and see what's going on with the Pisceans, okay? What's this? Okay. So, here guys, what's happening to the Pisces Zodiac in the month of May of 2024? Bow. We have the moon. Check the chart. We have our first placement of Pisces showing up. Some of you guys might have a Pisces moon. First of all, Pisces, a lot of you guys are very intuitive, girl. This is you tend to have very scary dreams because of how accurate or how detailed they usually be um some of you guys are very did i say intuitive intuitive discerning a lot of you guys are able to pick up on people's body language their voice changes i feel like a lot of you guys um are able to read body language very well and moods very well okay <gasps> congratulations i see some pisces could be pregnant during this time Yikes, okay. Now we got some bad news. We got some bad news, babe. Now, Chariot is out here. Not a Pisces card, but because you are a water sign, I would apply that to you. Pisces. Excuse me. I did say four of wands, six of swords, and the three of swords. That could be an individual um, pertaining to dating or just someone have you ever like gotten close to somebody you got vulnerable with them you kind of like felt like you were you were open to them and they do some bum shit okay six of swords and the three of swords they do some shit so cavalier like they do some shit to hurt you and they act so cavalier about it so cold so nonchalant chariot 
they just signed their exit papers. Okay, Chariot, leave they ass behind. Because with the moon card showing up here, I feel like this person did this um, because they were hiding something, because they were not a truthful person to begin with. Some of you guys, this could have definitely happened with an air sign, Libra, and Aquarius is out here. But I told you that you dropped that Gemini like a bad habit, okay? Um, there's a little bit of fire out here with this Four of Wands card. So we have Aries, and then we have the Sag card here. So here, guys, what's happening to the Pisces Zodiac in the month of May of 2024? Six of Wands, Nine of Pentacles. I do see that, Pisces, you are starting to feel more comfortable um, celebrating in silence, celebrating in private, enjoying your wins in private, like not being so public about everything that you're doing, everything that you're involved in during this time, everything that you're experiencing. It's like you want to you wanna enjoy things in private because with the moon card here, some of you guys know that energy is real. And it's like, there's just certain things about your life that you could be um, doing right now, experiencing to where it's like, you don't want to open that up to just any and everybody, okay? Yeah, Ace of Cups and the Nine of Pentacles with the World card. This is someone here getting into a certain relationship. And you know, what what's what what's what's the saying? Um I'm private about mine. I don't keep mine a secret, okay? In regards to being in a certain relationship with somebody. I also see that some of you guys have some haters. Moon card and the five of wands, or at least you have some people outside of you who secretly are, if not in competition with you, want to be better than you. Um, moon card and the six of wands. It's like not knowing someone's formula, very much giving plankton, not knowing how somebody is getting things done, doing things for themselves. And with the six of wands, they are really pulling it off. Like this person is really doing their thing. Um, and someone outside of you, Nine of Pentacles, Ace of Cups, World Card, and the Four of Wands. It's like someone here wants to live your life or wants to have the same sort of victories that you do. That's very odd. Ew. You know, it just gave me a chill. It's like somebody here, would, if they could, they would slip into your skin. We need to get the authorities. I don't like how that sounds. Well, this could be someone that you're staying away from during this time, or I'm warning you about. Um, four of Pentacles, Five of Cups, and the Ten of Swords. This could be someone here that, you know, um, I hated to do it, but I had to. Someone that with the Five of Cups, Ten of Swords, and the Four of Pentacles, I'm seeing you got tired of being hurt, disappointed, or dealing with back and forth with this person that you felt like they weren't changing. Um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Leo, Scorpio, Gemini. I feel like this person could definitely uh, feel some regret in how they mistreated you, how they handled you. But I think they still have a lot of growing up to do. It's like it's not enough for you to feel bad. All right. You got to actually want to do something about it. Spirit guys. What's happening to the Pisces Zodiac in the month of May of 2024? I also see someone here is keeping a pregnancy a secret. It's just, you know, they don't they don't want everybody in their business. There's nothing wrong. There's nothing going on. Six of Wands. It's like you don't find somebody here pregnant until they, they at the hospital. Okay, or they just pop up at a baby shower. Like, girl, where, where have you been, girl? Being pregnant. Five of Wands with the Knight of Swords. I told you, some of you guys definitely have some people around you who are in. I'm hearing an imaginary beef with you because you don't even see them. Yeah, look, 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 look. There's only room for one, okay? Six of Wands and the Five of Wands. This is like people competing for a spot that, you know, girl, you been had and you don't want anymore. Oh, God, you know what I just heard? Competing for someone that you been had but don't want, okay? Knight of Swords. 
Oh, Lord. Pisces women, Nine of Swords and the Devil card. You need to be careful about an air, earth, or fire sign individual who I feel like is very, what's the word? Momentary. Um, I feel like this person will only use you for the moment, okay? They will only invest in you. They're very inconsistent with how they treat others, with how they uh, consider others. I'm also saying this could be some sort of offer opportunity, Knight of Swords, Devil, and the Ace of Pentacles, what they say. Um, if the job way too easy for you to get, it's probably a bad job, all right? Now, I don't know about doing no three no three interviews. That's fucking crazy. Do y'all want an employee or not, okay? I don't know about that. But if they, you know, you you uh, send an application and they email you saying, you know, girl, you got the job. What? Y'all don't want to know my references? <laughs> Why do I want this job type shit? So be careful about that because what they say, you know, um, whenever the devil knows what you want, it, he, he can make a micro microwavable version very fast, very easy. But it's up to you to be discerning enough, moon card, to know like, uh-uh, girl, I don't do microwavables. Cook it in or on the stove, all right? You need to be careful about offers or opportunities like this, um, ways to get fast money, quick money. Um, or this is people. Yeah, girl, this is like somebody here wanting to get intimate with you way too fast. Someone here asking you for money. Sorry, guys, what's happening to the price? Oh, God damn. Excuse my, 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 uh, my profanity. Spirit guys, what's happening to the Pisces Zodiac in the month of May of 2024? Ten of Wands. With the star showing up on the bottom. Who, Pisces? I feel like you might not show it, but a lot of you guys um, are very... I just want to be successful. I feel like a lot of you guys, that is definitely your vibe, current status during this time. Uh, with the five of wands and ten of wands, you feel like you could be dealing with a lot of shit. Whether it be in regards to money, whether it be in regards to family, whether it just be in regards to like day-to-day -day bullshit. It's like, I got a lot of shit going on behind closed doors, okay? So while a bitch over there hating, talking about some other like I got all together and shit. You want these shoes, bitch? The star card is out here. But a lot of you guys are like, you know, girl, I give it over to God or whoever the ethers are to you. Okay, star card and eight of swords. A lot of y'all is like, I don't have the um, the energy to think my way through all this, girl. So with the star card, girl, I'm just like, man, fuck it. A lot of you guys have become a lot more like, I don't want to say apathetic about things in your life. But with the star card, you do believe that things will work out if they're supposed to. Moon card is out here. This for me is like you've seen things happen overnight or just unexpectedly in your life. It's like, girl, it's unexplainable. I don't know how it happened, but it did. Okay. I don't know how I did it, but I did it. Okay. So I can't, I can't you know, mentally strain myself whenever it comes to me dealing with bullshit, girl. It'll work itself out. <laughs> It'll work itself out, girl. Five of Cups. Yeah, I don't like to be unhappy. <laughs> I don't like to be stressed, girl. Send it up in the air <laughs> and I move on. That's your secret. That's what people are competing to find out about you. How you deal with shit. That is your secret. I don't care. No, but you have faith, star card, that things will work out. They have for me before. And with the moon card, I was I was never given an invoice. I was never given a receipt. I, I don't know how somebody paid for it or took care of it. But it happened. Spirit guys, what's happening to the Pisces Zodiac in the month of May of 20? Nah. 2024. They came my booty up, so I'm not gonna read it. Another one. Do either some of y'all got strong fire in your chart, or a lot of messages in this reading is about a fire sign. Excuse me. The only one card I have belong to you. All the other cards are fire. Eight of wands. Nine of cups. Oh, that's your card.
Yeah, Nine of Cups, Three of Wands, Knight of Wands, and the World card. A lot of you guys believe that as long as you let growth and evolution take place in your life, you get outside your comfort zone, you follow the blueprint World card, the Knight of Wands, Nine of Cups, and the Three of Wands. My destination, my outcome, I'll be fine, okay? I see some Pisceans, not all, but I see some Pisceans are delusional. First card out, moon card. It's like they believe that something here is going to work out. They believe that something here is going to be okay. But it's like with the Ten of Wands and the Eight of Wands, like, are you not paying attention to how things are turning out right now? Not a cousin of three of Wands. No, things will be okay. Like, I feel like someone here, remember what your overall energy is, Pisces, Carmen Masculine. You need to be careful about seeing all the red flags about having someone in your life dealing with someone being attached to something and you have this delusion nine of cups and the three of wands it'll be okay are you not are you not paying attention spirit guys what's happening to the pisces zodiac in the month of may of 2024 I see some of you guys have realized this about someone as well. Um, probably a fire sign. Uh, it's, it's sort of sad too. Because this for me is seeing how somebody is moving. Seeing the things that someone here is doing. And like, you know with the moon card and six of wands, this person could be so much better. Be doing, uh, be doing so much better uh, with the food card if they were to just change their ways. But you know, sometimes you got to let people do what they do. You got to let people fuck up. Some people don't know the stove is hot unless they touch it. You can't tell them nothing. Uh-uh, you can't tell me nothing. Very much Kanye West, yes. By the way, Miss Store <laughs> or Mrs. Interosante, that is the fool card for me. That is my trendsetter card. Somebody that is moving at the beat of their own drum, okay, on their spiritual journey type shit. Some of you guys with the moon card and the fool card, whenever you really are on that, you are missed or Mrs. Mysterioso, okay? The moon card is out here. It's like nobody knows how you are doing it. It almost looks like your life is on autopilot, okay? In a good way. I feel like some of you guys might notice that people are trying to behave like you, talk like you, do the same things that you do because they might see that you were someone that pulls it off very easily, very effortlessly. Not everybody can rock these shoes. You got yours custom, okay? Here you go, motherfucker. Try to squeeze they shit. That's, that's really like me. I'm keep moving. Spirit so guys, what's happening to the Pisces Zodiac in the month of May of 2024? King of Wands. I told y'all, some of y'all, these messages in this reading is definitely pertaining to a fire sign. Look at it. King of Wands, Ten of Wands, Eight of Wands, Six of Wands, Five of Wands. Oh my God. Who is this? Chariot. Damn. I hate this. Become some Pisces. This is someone here that you have to move on from. You have to move away from. They're no boy, no power to. Well, the way that they're moving, the things that they're getting involved in, that's why they're no boy, no power to. Or an air sign. It King of Swords is out here. It's either a fire or an air sign individual Pisces that I am warning you about. Now, some of you guys already got away from an individual like this. Moon card and the King of Wands? No, boy, no. Because I feel like this is someone here that might have a very good looking surface however you take that <laughs> but whenever you get behind okay whenever you start you know asking questions getting details about who this person is in their character you realize oh no five of wands and the ten of wands this is somebody here who um does not see the error in their ways this is someone here who talks out the ass, talks out their ass, like. I'm 
I'm gonna say it because there's strong masculine energy out here with Carmen Masculine. This is someone here who I feel like has a very misogynistic or uh, what is it, chauvinistic attitude, you know, like. This is a man who believes he should be fought over. Um, this is a man who feels as though he shouldn't have to do any hard work. He should just sit there and look good. And I give the same look to a broad that thought that. Like, bitch, who the fuck do you think you are? Okay? I would say the exact same thing to a bitch that I would say to a man who's like this. Who are you to expect all this and not do anything? Five of Wands, Food Card, and Ten of Wands. It's like someone here expects all this from you, but you give nothing. You do nothing. So with the Chariot Card, I think it's best that you might have to distance yourself from whoever this is. Um, with the Food Card out here, I think I said this earlier. This is someone here who still has a lot to learn in life. This could be someone younger because the Food Card is out here. Or it could just be someone that I'm hearing has not been held accountable for their actions. Spirit guys, what's happening to the Pisces Zodiac in the month of May of 2024? Eight of Pentacles with the Page of Wands. Uh, Pisces, please be careful about letting somebody here get in the way of your goals. Like, this is having the wrong friend, having the wrong uh, partner, <laughs> um, putting yourself in the wrong environments. It's like with the Knight of Cups, you were open to it, you were looking for it, but... moon card and the five of wands is like not doing your research not being more discerning about certain people or a certain situation fool card some things you shouldn't just you know step out <laughs> you shouldn't just take a leap of leap of faith okay queen of swords let me be smart about this okay hold up last card spirit guys what's happening to the pisces zodiac in the month of may of 2024 nine of pentacles with the ace of pentacles mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Hmm. i don't like it i really don't uh, Pisces, Four of Cups, Mish, and High Priestess, Death card, Two of Pentacles, Knight of Swords, Sun card, and the Ace of Pentacles. Um, I feel like someone is going to come around you wanting some sort of second chance, and I don't feel like you should award it to them. I mean, it's up to you, okay? Some of you guys might have a little bit of a warmer heart than I do, but the only reason why I feel like you should maybe, you know, pull back on doing that is because with the Five of Wands knight of swords two of pentacles and the four of cups it's like i said this earlier this looks like someone here who you know rarely ever faces um consequences for their actions and this could be also with the moon card someone that like They like to make things seem one way when it's another way. Like, this is someone here who will, if they can, blame things on other people. They won't take, um, what's the word I'm looking for? They won't take accountability. And I feel like sometime down the road, you will wind up dealing with a certain situation where you're now putting a bad, you're, you're putting a bad position because of this person. This could be an Aquarius, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, Virgo. And some of y'all already on that type of time. Yeah, girl, I know. Seven of Swords. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No. No, ma'am. 
four of cups high priest and the death card some of you guys i feel like have already done this with someone um yeah this is someone here who thinks they can just do whatever and there'll be someone there to clean up their mess or wait for them on hand and foot so this is you know somebody here who spends their money recklessly and think they can just ask anybody for money and not pay them back this is someone here who you know does you dirty in a certain romantic situation and then think they can just come back like didn't nothing happen um this is like somebody here who thinks they can get over and then, you know, come back. Either because it's been a little while, King of Wands, they think that their looks might get them that. Or this person might think that they're smart. Like, they don't even know. Girl, please. They sent me the dream two weeks ago. Shut up. Pisces, this was your May monthly reading. Check your chart for any Pisces uh, placement because Moon and Pisces is definitely out here. But you could have any placement of Pisces.